Well, good morning, good night, or good afternoon, viewers, depending on your time zone. And this is Failboat's YouTube, and this is also Failboat eh, playing, you know, Minecraft. Mm, you know, I got a little dirt thing here, a little pool, a rainbow rug, and LOL JK. Why is that door open? LOL JK, I'm playing Latura, which is kind of like a Minecraft clone, but because it's only an alpha, don't blame it. Don't worry, let's get it. It's gonna get a lot more advanced going on. But you can already see there's a lot of changes. We got some little borders around the blocks, which are very nice. Not the selection block, but you know, little borders. You can probably see them. You know what I'm talking about. You know what I mean. We also got some curves, so everything's not all that blocky. And given that it's only alpha, this is gonna get a lot bigger. And you know, it's only been up out since I think October 2nd. Uh, but yeah, ten dollars on on. Uh, on alpha and it'll get more expensive as time goes on to beta and then the, eventually the final release but yeah guys this is a house made out of everything minecraft also I, I have everything in the game also quick thing if you're not watching this on my channel my channel is youtube.com slash so yeah go subscribe there because i'm going to be doing a video error review every time uh, Latura, uh, uh, bleh, every time Latura updates so yeah guys now, let us move on to the different blocks here. Also, quick thing, that's my insignia made out of topiary. Hell yeah. Also, Leafman. But yeah, guys, let's go over what the blocks are in this. As you can see, oh, bleh. First things first, though, controls. We got W, A, S, D to move around, space to jump, you know, mouse to move, around, mouse to look around, left click to break stuff, and press 1 and 2. 1 and 2 to shuffle through the thing at the bottom there to select what block you want to place by pressing right click and if you press F oh yeah if you hold shift you use some speed running right there also this is not optimized if you go into new chunks it will lag hor horribly horribly with a rolled R hell yeah uh, if you press F3 you'll go into new clip mode which you know you gotta go slow E to, uh, e to go up Q to go down and also I know what people will do they will press space that is not how it works um, space will just randomly send you up into space. Eh, there you go. Space to go to space. Actually, on that note, this game is eventually going to adapt into space. Uh, and by that I mean, right now, you know, there's not really any resources at all. Just plainly stone, you know, generated caves. Eventually, there will be minerals here. But there's also going to be minerals on other planets. And also, like, other mobs on other planets. Oh, it's going to be nice. It's going to be nice. Um, this is also a game made by the people who made the... Uh, evil Minecraft mod. So, if you like that mod, or don't like the mod, or haven't even heard of the mod, download this game. It's awesome. And it'll be advancing a lot more. But now, without further ado, the blocks. Le, le blocks. Here we go. We've got some stone, cobblestone, obsidian, bedrock, igneous rock, which I kind of think as gravel, even though it doesn't have the gravity effect. We've got some grass, dirt, sand, which has gravity. Gravity. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing that. Gravity. We got some water, which again, no gravity. Uh, lava, no gravity, or a burning sensation at that rate. We also have some logs, and here we go, the leaves. For the fourth time, I am failing at recording this for some reason. My recorder does not want to work. D different means. Also, on that note, really fast. Um, if you were wondering why there are missing chunks there, <laughs> and uh, uh, like, a, like a little crown thing there, and you know, half a... Half a testificate village. That is because currently in alpha, there's a glitch. If you're watching this outside of alpha, you don't have to worry about this, but currently in the first update, given that it's only been out since October 2nd, it's probably been a patch soon enough. <laughs> there, sometimes you'll get uh, an error called null pointer exception, where it'll take pretty much all the saplings that were around you and delete their chunks and delete all the hard work you put into making a testificate village. So, so yeah. Ugh. Anyway, moving on there. <laughs> Damn it. Damn that bug. But now onto the leaves. The leaves. Whenever you place down a leaf, it'll, you know, leaf block. It'll be a normal leaf block. But when you start to place leaf blocks next to leaf blocks, they'll sort of take on their own little shapes, which is really nice. It can lead to some awesome looking shapes, even little diamond patterns. Um, and light glitches. Can't forget light glitches. There's also the next uh, next thing here. We got some cacti. Cacti start out small but get bigger over time. But as you can see, different extensions with different cacti. 
And as you can see, you know, once they grow up, there'll be different cacti. All, everything's kind of random in terms of the extensions, uh, including no cacti. No cacti extensions, extensions even for you. Ha! Bitch, cacti. Think you can do what it wants. You also have flowers. You can place these flowers down, and you'll come up with seven different colors. Uh, those being red, blue, yellow, pink, Kirby pink even, white, green, and light blue. C cyan. Cyan. Take that. Got it right this time. We got some glass, some wooden planks, some glass panes, which are not a pane this time. Because they even attach the sides. They even attach the sides of walls and are very, very versatile. Like you can see right there. A little pit right there. I don't know why I'm rolling ours. I don't know. We got some normal stairs and upside down stairs. Uh, normal slabs and sideways slabs, which is really awesome. And also, my favorite part of this being the uh, rainbow carpet. The rainbow carpet is when you place it down singularly. You pretty much have a little rainbow textured carpet. It's probably going to be changed later. But, uh, sorry, it's actually called a rug. Excuse me. Just with the tool tips up there, yeah. When you place down other things next to the rug, you'll create little patterns, which are really nice. And also, don't laugh. I know what it looks like, and I know it's a rainbow pattern. Get over it, you sick son of a... Yep. Yep. Why? I don't know. Because an awkward looking T. <laughs> I don't know. Also, we have some lanterns. Lanterns are really cool looking, but currently don't produce any light. They will eventually. We got some fences with some awesome curvature and some awesome tilting. We got some doors that are placed in the middle of a block. And, you know, when activated with the right click, we'll kind of go back and forth. They'll alternate what side they go on next. So let's just go through there for some odd reason. And move on to the next thing, which would be... Oh, <laughs> apparently, if you hold on... If you hold E with physics disabled, you kind of do a little bouncing thing. <laughs> giggity, 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 giggity. <laughs> Don't laugh. I know you are. Anyway, these are stools. Uh, yeah, nice little things. They should be added to Minecraft. All that great stuff. Now we have tables, which are really awesome. Tables, singularly, are, you know, just normal tables. But when you start to place tables next to each other, they start to form other, you know, different shaped tables, which create awesome things. We also have some blueprint tables here, which I think will be the crafting table once uh, this game is officially released. We also have some forges and some stoves. And also we have an anvil. So yeah, guys, that's all the blocks. And also, grass tilting is amazing whenever there's like a hole or anything. Oh, it's, it's, it's really nice. It's, <laughs> drop it. No, it's really nice. Uh, but thank you all for watching. My, now my Facebooks are not disabled. And yeah, guys definitely check out this I hope to gosh that this recording saves and thank you all for what <laughs> I love this thing oh my gosh it looks so cool and thank you all for watching I'm gonna be doing a video of Latura every time there's a new update and yeah guys thank you all for watching and normally if you aren't uh, familiar with my channel I do a sign off with a golden scythe which is what that's supposed to rep represent in topiary form um, a golden scythe however you know you people will call it a golden hoe but right here we got myself a golden scythe replica, aka lantern. And that's all I will be using to do my sign out. So yeah, guys, thank you all for watching. I really hope I included everything in this recording. And making sure, yeah. Thank you all for watching. And do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. See you around.